Today we've got these voltage divider boards. We actually designed them in-house, and what they're going to let you do is easily attach an analog sensor to your Arduino. Now, there's a lot of different types of analog sensors. One of our popular ones are these force sensors. And most analog sensors are just variable resistors. That means as you activate the sensor, the resistance on them is going to change. When you attach your variable resistor to a fixed resistor, you can build a voltage divider circuit. This circuit will generate a voltage based on the analog sensor's input. This voltage can be fed in the Arduino, which will interpret it as a value, and then you can use that value to activate different objects. In this case, by applying different force to the sensor, we can adjust the brightness of the LED. So let's take a look at the voltage divider board. It's got a two-pin male header, so if you've got a female header like our force resistors, you can just plug it straight in. Now if you don't have that kind of header, you can use this screw terminal block to attach your sensor into since it's electrically connected to the same pins. We've also got this three pin header here that has ground and voltage that you'll feed from your Arduino to the board and then signal that you'll feed from the board to your analog input on your Arduino. Now finally we have this potentiometer here. Normally this potentiometer is not going to change. It's going to be the fixed resistor I was talking about before. However, you can adjust the potentiometer to tune the sensitivity of your variable resistor, your sensor. These voltage divider boards will work with any analog sensor that provides a variable resistance. Flex sensors, positional sensors, all sorts of sensors. And as you can see here, the boards hook really cleanly into breakout boards or using our squid cable straight into your Arduino. So it's a really easy and clean way to get sensors and attach them to your Arduino.